Hello and welcome back to US Market Board. My name is Scott Newman and today we're going to talk about cleaning a whiteboard. What you have here is a very messy whiteboard. I know I use it every day. First thing we're going to do is we're going to use a new product called Greenworks by Clorox. It's a really great cleaner. It's easy to use. It will take off most of the uh, dry erase dust left by your markers. One of the things you need to know is, in one of my earlier videos, is what markers to use. Now I know a lot of people like to use low odor markers, but low odor markers don't dry as well, nearly as well, as regular dry erase markers do. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to try to clean off all of this. We're going to use this cleaner, and then we're going to use some dishwashing liquid. We're going to get it nice and clean, and then we're going to take a look at how it works with a good dry erase marker. So we're going to spray this stuff on, and as we go through it, it will start to lift off all of the old dry erase marker and ghosting that is left over. And as we start to wipe it off, you'll see that the board comes nice and clean. But that's only part of the process. Okay. Now, you might think that the board is nice and clean. We got everything off of it we could with the cleaner. And the next thing we're going to do, and I put a little bit of dishwashing liquid in it. And all I did was I took a little dishwashing liquid with, uh, with some water, mixed it up. And now I'm going to take dishwashing liquid and I'm going to soap up the board. And I'm really going to get that board clean. I'm going to take all of the ink out of it. And what you might not see is on my paper towel, there's still a lot of ink left on there. So this soap and water is really getting in there to get the rest of it out. I'm going to do that one more time. do is we're going to let that dry for a minute. We're going to come back in a second. I'm going to use some clear water. I'm going to go over it again. I'm going to dry it with a nice clean paper towel and then we're going to take a look and see what it looks like with a good marker. Okay, so we're back. We're going to go and I got some nice clean water and we're going to wipe this over, lift up all of the ref leftover residue and the soap. I'm going to clean it off and we're going to do this a couple of times until there's absolutely nothing but clear paper towel in my hands. So now my whiteboard is in the condition that I got it in. We're going to give it another second to dry, make sure there's no wet spots. Here we are, back again. Nice clean whiteboard. We've used our cleaner to clean the whiteboard. We've used our dishwashing liquid. We've washed it off with clean water a few times. We've wiped it so it's nice and dry. And now we're going to go ahead and test it. In one of our earlier newsletters, I had recommended and my tips from Scott, which markers to use. Today I'm using the Quartet marker. It's uh, the Endora Glide. It's a dry erase marker. Uh, it's it's a, one, of my, one of my favorites. So, draw a nice little smiley face on it. Dry erase markers need a second to dry, otherwise you end up smudging it. We're going to take a look, and we're going to wipe off our beautiful smiley face, and we have a nice, clean whiteboard. I want to thank you very much for coming to U.S. Marker Board and watching our video. Please do give us a call. Thank you very much and have a great day.